Hi guys, it's your girl, Queen Honeybee, aka Flower Girl. Anyway, I'm coming to y'all with a really short crafting um, video on these cute little dream journals slash manifestation journals that I create. I just want to show you guys how it's done. Here we got the plain journal. This one has 80 pages. Um, the way I want to decorate this one is sort of theme like this, which is like the nature and the flower theme. So with the cover, I actually am going to use some faux grass, which I think is going to be so cute. Just like, okay, stay with, just, just stay with me here. Look, just watch. So we're going to keep the, the metal showing, of course. And then the cover of the book is going to look something like something like this. Can you imagine walking around with a book, a notebook, a dream journal, a manifestation book, whatever, a planner that looks like this? Like, it's so cute. It's so cute. And so um, I got some real pine cones and I have real roses, real dried roses. And I kind of want to um, hot glue gun them to the grass, but we'll see once everything is kind of like put together but like i said let's take a look at this journal because some of the traits of this journal is definitely gonna be in here because i have signatures like the opening it's always a pocket that's gonna be here so we're gonna put a pocket there and we can decorate the pages however we want that's just like a freestyle but i do kind of want to do it different so stay with me and then the back page will always have a manifestation mirror for your manifestations and affirmations. These are mine. I say mine daily. I actually have a lot coming to fruition. If you guys check out my subscribers, um, it's, Jan it's February 20th and I have, I'm at 185 subscribers. So I created this journal like in the beginning of the uh, year, which was January last month. And I wrote down, I, I write down a lot of manifestations, but more recently, I wrote down that before um, February is out, I will have 200 subscribers. And daily, I am climbing. And, you know, it, it's all with intent and, and just literally seeing is believing and just taking action on what you would like to see in your life. And uh, I, I, like I said, let's get on it because I can talk about this book all day. And it's just so cute. And it's like, why wouldn't you want to carry it around because I have so many notebooks like this plain just sitting around but it's like when I know I need to write it's so easy for some reason I guess because it's so cute and I can just turn to literally any page and some of the pages are like envelopes you can play with it a lot I got if this one folded over and stickers right here so can't nobody see because that's like a my top secret page for me. So no one would even notice to be like, oh, let me look. So it's kind of like a diary, journal, planner, shit. Put your whole life in here and take it with you. But um, let's let's get started, okay? So what you're gonna need um, for this video, well, you're just gonna need a, glue, a hot glue gun, a hot glue gun, um, some fabric, more fabric. <laughs> A whole lot more fabric okay because the, that fabric is gonna be going in between the pages so that's why you're gonna need lots and lots and lots of fabric and if you don't want to do it that's fine you can definitely click that link in the description or in the comments you can buy one <laughs> I'll send it to you you know but um, I like to get really creative with these journals and you gotta need some scissors too so it's just a couple things you'll need. Hot glue gun, scissors, and the material and the fabric. And whatever decoration you use, I get like a lot of my stickers from Michael's. And um, a lot of his fabric is from like Joanne's fabric. But let's, one second. Okay guys, I am back with my supplies. And I also made a mini. <laughs> It's upside down. But this is the mini version um, of the Dream Journal. And it's a, um, supposed to be a keychain hole right here. But I'm making mini journals so you can take literally take them on the go with you. And yes, they do have pages. 
They do have pages. You can actually write in them. They're decorated literally just like these ones. I'm going to get a tiny mirror because I do have tiny mirrors. I'm going to get a tiny mirror. And in the front, yeah. It's just so cute. One second. Okay. So, yes. The hot glue gun is hot. So, we can go ahead and cut the fabric. Like I said, I don't want this to be a long video. Okay. So... Let's cut her up. And this, this I um, I got from Family Dollar. It is literally so crazy. Five dollars. But every time I go there, I cannot find it. <laughs> I cannot find it anymore. But I have, I have a whole lot. I have a whole lot. So I'm gonna be making these journals with the grass until they literally run out and until I sell out. So you guys have better hurry and purchase these journals if you want. The grass ones because I'm telling you, I can't find the babies nowhere. Um, which is kind of cool because I'm gonna be the only one walking around with the grass journal. <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna cut her like so. And then, because I literally want the perfect measurement, I don't, I hate wasting product, material product, whatever. I hate wasting. Cause it's money babes it's money so um, i can at least get like two more covers out of that if i if i cut good if i cut good okay Ugh, if i cut good y'all this is the first let's see okay cut it like that okay her out <laughs> and I'm only gonna do it on the cover I'm not gonna do it on the back I'm gonna have something really cute for the back okay so let's take our glue gun and I really love how this one has the little strap where it's just like you know for privacy or whatever so yeah perfect fit guys Oh my gosh, this is so cute. <laughs> Can you imagine walking around with this? Can you imagine? Like, no, seriously. Okay, I'm I'm a nature girl and I'm earth sign. I love everything earth, animals, and just natural. So <laughs> this is exciting to me. Glue gun um, will not stretch. So. Um, let's push position her this way. Okay. So what you guys are gonna do, let's take that out of the equation. What I'm gonna do is just yeah, I get her. Make sure I hit all the corners though. I'm gonna make sure I hit all the corners because damn it. Okay. We'll just use red. I just bought some clear ones, but I don't feel like getting up and going to get it. Because, oh, I did. I got them. Shout out to Family Dollar coming through with the clear um, glue sticks. Because the glitter ones are cute, but if I'm using it just to like cover up something, it's like, okay, that was a waste. So the clear ones are very much clutch. Okay, so let's finish. We're going to hit the corners because you want to make sure um the circumference is sticking yeah. okay so i guess we gotta wait for that to be okay okay oh wow okay she's on there <laughs> she's on there y'all and she is sticking and she is literally hugging i love it i love it so the good thing about this glue is it's basically um plastic so if you get it on the paper i gotta just take it off so with the remaining so this is how it looks um I am going to fix this because I need to cut that because, um, like I said, I wanted this to be the binder to be showing. 
So um, I'm just gonna cut that and so that can show because I do want the body to show. But um, let's start on the inside. So for the inside fabric, like I said, I'm gonna have a little pocket right here because in the dream journal, I have a pocket on the inside where I can put pens, pictures, gum, you know, stuff like that. Um, and so I'm just gonna make another one. And I really like this fabric because it goes with the theme of the book it, with the flowers in the back. Come on, how cute can it get? Okay. I'm so mad, guys. Like, this video is going to be really short, but I'm not going to take you through step to step because it's going to take too long, but I will show you the finished results because I am finishing this book today. Give me a second. <laughs> okay, y'all. So I'm not quite done, but I just got this really cool idea. Remember how I said I wanted to do the front, like, really unique? Okay, so these butterflies, regular butterfly clips, right? I'm just going to have and pop off this little metal part, right? Bam, you got two butterflies, right? One second. <laughs> Hot glue gun to the butterflies. This is so amazing, like, yeah, I love crafting, it is so fun. My inner child is like hugging the crap out of me right now. Um, so this is, I'm not quite finished, but okay guys, so I am on the first page of cutting. We got the fabric right here and you just want to want to measure it, um, about the same length of your page. So like I said, it doesn't need to be perfect, but the first one is gonna go on the first page and you are going to um, wrap her around. So she'll be showing front and back and that's how you're gonna get that illusion. And so I do every other page. So there's 80 pages, so it's gonna be 40 decorated because I did half, I believe I did half. Does it look like half? Because this is 100 pages, I think I did half, yeah. About 20. One second. Even though I'm running out of time, I do want to show some of the process of me um, creating my dream journal. Okay. One second. Okay, so with the felt stickers, I use two or yeah, one on each side. So I already put one on the front like that. And I want her to stick out. So when you close the book, she's there. So we're gonna go ahead and put it on the back part so it won't be, you know, sticking to the back of the page. And I put these all down the page. And like I said, you'll be able to see her sticking out just like these ones. Let me show you. There she is. Just like these ones. And it's front and back as well. So yeah. One second. <laughs> 